today. We are from the University of Santo Tomas, CAMSET Project 3 team, and we are happy to share with you our research work on fabric supercapacitors. The Philippines is a developing and growing nation. But this also means that our demand for energy is also increasing. There are currently many problems with the use of non-renewable and renewable power sources like solar and wind power. Some such problems are scarcity and intermittent power. Energy storage devices can help with these problems by providing regulation, contingency, and management to existing power grids. As modern technology becomes more mobile, energy storage units such as batteries are becoming more essential. Carrying an extra battery pack or power pack is often used to charge electronic devices on the go. But today, we will present to you another energy storage device called the supercapacitor. Supercapacitors have high power densities. This is how fast the energy could be released. This means that these devices have charging times of several seconds against batteries that we need about 10 to 60 minutes to fully charge. Batteries also have a short cycle life of about 500 cycles. In comparison, a supercapacitor has about a million cycles. It means it can be charged many times without losing its energy storing capacity. But of course, supercapacitors have a limitation. It can only store a small amount of energy. But even if the energy stored is in small amounts, it is adequate for various low power applications, like sensors or wearable devices. For the electrode material of our supercapacitor, we are using Philippine indigenous fabrics like fibers from abaca, piña, banana, and water hyacinth. We are also using agricultural wastes like rice husks or rice straws to make biochar. And this biochar will give us more porous electrode material for our supercapacitor, which can increase the amount of energy our device can store. The resulting fabric supercapacitor is therefore sustainable, renewable, and environmentally friendly. Where can we apply the use of these fabric supercapacitors? For modern and current technologies, these can be used by people residing in places where there is no access to grid power or it is very inefficient to install wind turbines or solar panels. They can also be used for future wearable and flexible technology. For example, our seniors can have this wearable technology to have easier access to emergency services. Likewise, they can also assist in the geolocation of children and hikers. All of these technologies can also be easily powered via solar, wind, or even our very own kinetic power, which are very accessible anywhere. We hope you have learned something today and understood what a fabric supercapacitor is, a flexible energy storage device that can be charged quickly and has a long cycle life, a sustainable, renewable, and environmentally friendly solution to our energy problems. Thank you very much.